Calvin Sanford is only 15 years old, not even old enough to drive. Yet prosecutors say he led police on a high-speed chase in a stolen truck that ended in a deadly crash. Mr. Sanford is present. At his bond hearing Thursday, Daniel Moreno, whose mother was killed in the crash, urged the judge to keep him locked up. I would just hate for somebody else to lose them all. Prosecutors say on March 12th, Sanford and three other minors had stolen a truck. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Tampa police officer Darren Gibson spotted the stolen truck in East Tampa, and the chase was on. At times, he said he could barely keep up. Uh, at least my explorer at red lines at 105. Um, so, when you say 105, you mean 105, uh, 105 miles, per hour. miles per hour? Yes, sir. The high-speed chase would end in Plant City, where they say Sanford crashed into a black Honda Civic, killing 44-year-old Maria Torres. Her son-in-law was behind the wheel. And then my mother-in-law, she was just like hanging out of the vehicle, and like just it was just the worst thing. His wife barely survived and is now in a wheelchair. Sanford was arrested. However, one boy, Christopher Small, took off running, but was eventually caught. In court, the judge made him tuck his shirt in before heading to the witness stand. Once there, he didn't want to talk. I want to testify. Small later returned and pointed the finger at Sanford as the driver of the stolen truck. So you're pointing at Mr. Sanford now as the driver. Is that because you don't want to be accused yourself? No. But you were in the stolen truck. Yeah. After hours of testimony, the judge decided the teen suspect wasn't going anywhere except back to jail. Bond was denied. Gloria Gomez, Fox 13 News. Sanford is charged with vehicular homicide and grand theft.